Well, we're in the rainy western part of Germany, and it has been raining in the build-up to the game here in Dortmund. I'm Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by Lee Dixon, and we've got UEFA Champions League group stage action to bring you tonight. It is Borussia Dortmund up against Monaco. Well, with one point in match day one, the visitors come here hoping to get all three points, but one point is never a bad result away from home. This is the lineup for Dortmund. Roman Burki gets the nod in goal. Lukas Piszczek plays with Marcel Schmelzer as fullbacks. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one front runner this evening. This is what they'll be facing today. It does rather look as though it's going to be a battle of the 4 5 1 formations in this game. Similar setups, Lee. Well, it looks lovely in the graphic, doesn't it? There's players everywhere. They have got the freedom to roam around the pitch how they see fit. There is some structure to it, but that lone striker up front needs support, not only around it, but from wide areas of two. The supply line will come from the wide midfield players and maybe the overlapping fullbacks. Now Thomas Delaney, Schmelzer, Abdul Diallo. The ball with Marco Reus. And Marco Reus, usually so very creative, can be difficult to stop. Lee, in what way might he contribute here? Well, he's strong, he's a good runner, but above all, he's intelligent. Just watch the positions he takes up on the pitch. Lukas Piszczek with it. Nice. He's taken on the shots, but he's failed to beat the goalkeeper from there, Lee. Well, it was well worth the effort, but uh, well off target. Benjamin Henrichs. Here's Tielemans. Ronnie Lopez. Given away by Monaco. Jemerson now. This is Glick. Now Ronnie Lopez. Galavin. Now do they mean business on this occasion? Nasser Shadley. Well, can he make this move count? And it's with CD Bay. He has plenty of support. Now what can he do here? Benjamin Henrichs. Space and time for the cross. Well, let's see. Does he mean business? Is he going to punish them here? Pulisic now. And Bitzel with it. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Not to be in terms of the cross there. Goal kick coming up. Tielemans CD Bay well he's given it away and Witzel with it given away Dortmund have been awarded the free kick by the referee the ball with Marco Reus Alcázar Marco Reus Here's Piszczek. Delaney. And this is Royce. Now well, regaining possession for his side cleverly. They don't normally need a second invitation to give it a go on the counter. And given away. Looks as though they might make real progress on the counter attack. Not so. Marco Royce. But it's a fine-looking Dortmund attack, but the question is, what can they do from this position? Galavine. 
Let's see what he has in store for them. Falcao! And a goal it is, the opener in this game. Well, keep it tight, that's what both managers would have been saying. But now the opening goal's gone in. Tactics have got to change. Well, it's not a brilliant goal, but it's a goal. It's in the back of the net. Keeper couldn't do anything about it. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? The opening goal of the game, then. Axel Witzel. Diallo on the ball. Now Thomas Delaney. An authoritative challenge. Promising attack this from Borussia Dortmund. What can they do from here? Options are plenty. This corner kick might help them. And that's a deep corner. Attending to his defensive chores. Given away by Monaco. An attempt like that, never likely to trouble the keeper. No, he's got his positioning right, but it was a... And there the first half ends here in Dortmund. And they start the second half. It's Monaco in command of the game. And it's with Falcao now. Running towards goal. One man to beat. And unfortunate with that chip Lee, just over the top. Oh, he's done everything right. He's gone over the keeper, but unfortunately he's gone over the bar as well. Abdou Diallo and Witzel with it. Pulisic now. Lukas Piszczek with it. Jemerson. Here's Tielemans. He's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Lee? Well, his manager will be delighted with him. He's been spot on in this game, hasn't he? Energy, imagination, desire and a steely determination. His checks ball into the centre. Clattered away. Given away by Monaco. Now Cather. Jaden Sancho. Tielemans. Well, great read there to intercept. Much defensive cover there on the flank. And crossing, peace check. And they deal with the threat this time. The effectiveness of the high press. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. Marco Reis. Sancho now. It's a story of forward momentum from Borussia Dortmund. Can they produce? Schmelzer. Well, that's not watertight defending. And no-nonsense defensive clearance. Garavin. Tielemans. Ronnie Lopez. Falcao has it. Well, regaining possession for his side cleverly. Jaden Sancho. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in. Substitution it is for Dortmund. Now Ronnie Lopez. Nasser Shadley. And can he make this move count? Not too fussy in clearing his lines. And they'll have to throw it back in play. 
Now, Ronnie Lopez. Fine cross into the middle. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. Not messing around with that clearance. Paco Alcata. Pulisic. Alcata. And Witzel with it. Royce. And now here's Henrichs. Here's Tielemans. Benjamin Henrichs. Chadley has it. Cameo Glick. Tielemans. Attempting to play catch-up in this second half. Lee, what ought the priorities to be? Well, Dortmund, for me, not been their best night of football, but they're still in this game. That's the most important thing. We used to say on the pitch, you'll get one more chance before the end if you're losing. Will they get one? Less than convincing defending. Well, far from the cross he had in mind. Goal kick it is. They will now make use of those. Substitutes bench. Something you don't see every day of the week. A triple substitution here. CD Bay. Here's Tielemans. Antonio Barreca. And I must say, it's a fine-looking attack. But what can they do from this position? Options are plenty. Electing to cross into the centre. And you need your defender to take charge. Wonderful block. Will there be a tangible end product? Well, the attack promising as it was. Scuppered there. Jaden Sancho. And only two minutes remaining here. Mario Götze. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Inside he goes. But Mario Götze putting his body on the line. Well, this might be their final opportunity to draw level. So the corner played into the box. And good, sir. The finish, a good one from Mario Götze. Here's the replay, and I can see why the keeper's a little frustrated. He thought he got enough on that to keep it out, but it's just come past him, and he's unlucky, really. And a bit more analysis as regards the goal. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. One minute remaining. And that will be all for tonight. You've got to say more positives than negatives for them in the group so far. Yeah, absolutely. Four points after two games. Uh, B plus, something like that. It's a good start. It's not excellent. But they're in a really good position to progress now to the knockout stages. Still a bit of work to be done, though. And he puts in a really thorough performance tonight.